concerned. This is my daughter, Sarah. We're not that far, no, no, you're, you're staying. Uh, we're not that far past Memorial Day, and uh, that's the second most important holiday next to Christmas, as far as I'm concerned. Because I couldn't be a Christian and believe in Christ in a free country if it wasn't for the people who spilled their blood for the right for me to believe like I want to believe. So Sarah's going to do a poem by my request about that. My country under God My country under God I stand on my land It's sacred ground I'll not surrender I'll not stand down My country knows No king No crown My country's under God My country Under God My country are gonna run rough shot over my country under God. Driving our beat up old pickup truck, toting a hefty load, nine horses in the trailer up the windy Elk River Road. I sit next to my two sisters, dad over there on the left. Something new at the neighbor's place, a coming on into sight. Why, it's a real tall flagpole, old Gloria waving there. That's mighty nice, says one of us, and we all just kind of stared. Well, I was thinking of a proud America as he rolled on up near where it's at, and all of a sudden, Dad reaches up and takes off his old hat. Well, he never said a word. And for him, that's kind of strange. Put it on again in a while as he rolled on up towards the range. But then I'm not. Gripping my throat. And tears welled in my eyes. I thinking to myself, thank God old glory flies. Thank God old glory flies for the rich and for the poor. Thank God for our freedom, dearly paid for in the wars. I thank God most of all because I'm free to be a cowgirl, because that's what I want to be. Thank God all glory flies for all of you and for me. Now, I don't know about you, partner, but I'll stand right here and say, I'm mighty proud of those who serve the grand old USA. <laughs> years ago, uh, my granddaughter was born with a condition called osteogenesis imperfecta, that's brittle bone disease. And not to cast too serious of a note over the crowd, she's an inspiring, wonderful girl, even though she's broken more than 80 bones in her life and had eight surgeries and uh, is still in a wheelchair at 12 years old. She's brilliant, she's funny, she keeps us going. And uh, she also tutors high school students how to pass the ACT test. 
Since she hasn't had as much physical activity as other kids, she's used her mind. She's taught me that when you have some kind of dysfunction in your life, use the good things that you have to make it. So uh, tonight, my son, her father, is going to sing a song about her. And I want you to know that we're going to do a silent auction on this guitar, which I'm going to autograph for you with your favorite song on it. When you come tell me after the show what your favorite song is, if you have the winning bet, I'll write your, the lyrics to your favorite song on it, put your name on it. And it's all going to go to the Fiona Rose Murphy Foundation for children who have challenging diseases and where insurance doesn't cover their disability and to help them have a better quality of life. Fiona Rose. 